my channel. My name is Christy. If you're new here, I am a wedding photographer located in Ohio and a videographer. I thought I would sit down and do this video because literally <laughs> I have been a bride myself. My husband and I have been married for almost three years now and obviously since I'm a wedding photographer, I shoot a lot of weddings and I interact with brides like all the time. Yeah, this has been on my mind lately just because when I'm talking to my brides and just like family and friends going through wedding planning and stuff, everyone stresses about the little things and really those little things you guys don't really care about. Yeah, that's what this video is going to be about. So basically just kind of giving you a lowdown of really things that your guests don't care about and things that you shouldn't worry about and that are causing you stress. I know that you're probably still gonna stress about these things. We're human, it happens, I totally get it, but I'm just hoping by making this video, I can help you stress a little bit less. So, that is my goal. So, <laughs> yeah. Number one, I, I, don't, I don't have these written down. I'm just gonna kinda go off memory and like, things that I've witnessed and stuff like that. Um, but the first thing I'm gonna say that guests do not give a fart about is invitations. I'm sorry to all you stationary <laughs> vendors out there, but you do beautiful work and it's beautiful in photos, but the guests just don't really care what they look like. They just read it real quick, put it on their fridge or put it in their calendar when they have to be at the wedding and that's it. Personally, I mean, I love invitations, mainly because I'm a photographer, so I think they're pretty, but I've heard people say that they just throw them away, like right when they get them and stuff like that. So that's something that you really shouldn't waste your money on, uh, unless that is something super important to you. Okay, just to clarify, yes. So I'm gonna say these things, but if that something is super important to you, like, then obviously <laughs> disregard that. But I'm just saying what I've witnessed and all that stuff. Back to the video. So yeah, invites really aren't that big of a deal. Don't stress about it. Yeah, but they don't really care what they look like necessarily. Um, so don't stress about that. Um, another thing, huge, huge thing that guests do not care about. I promise you guests do not care about these. Favors. 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 <laughs> Literally, I remember playing my wedding and I was like, crap, mom, like, I don't know what to get for favors. Like I was stressing so hard about it because I was wanting to get cute favors and like make them DIY and like all this stuff. No, like don't waste your time. Honestly, <laughs> I wouldn't even give favors. Like if I was getting married now, my mom and I were just talking on the phone today, I would not even give favors because I see so many leftover favors at a wedding. It is ridiculous. It's ridiculous, honestly. So don't go crazy about your favors. Don't stress about them. If you get them, cool, love it. If not, it's not a big deal. Your guests aren't gonna be like, oh my God, where's my favor? Like I didn't get a favor at so-and-so's wedding. So it's not it's not a big deal. Your guests are not gonna care about that if they don't get a favor. <laughs> like seriously, it's no big deal. Another thing would be programs. Again, guests don't really care about programs. They just wanna get in the ceremony, get out and start drinking. The three main things that your guests care about, and it's sad, but it's the truth, is <laughs> the food. You have to have good food, for sure. Music, obviously, it's a party, you need a good DJ. And booze. <laughs> I mean, they know they're getting free alcohol, as most weddings do offer free alcohol. So that's what they really care about, is if there's at least beer and wine, um, good music and good food and it's sad to say that but I feel like that's really what the truth is I mean when I attend a wedding I'm like oh like being completely honest with you that's how I attend a wedding I'm like oh, I hope the food's really good like I'm excited to see them get married but like I'm excited to party with them you know so I don't know but that's just attending a wedding like obviously when I'm photographing I'm like so in the emotions and like there for them and it's so fun completely different mindset but I don't know it's it's so it just makes me sad the little things that brides stress about when you really don't need to 
and I'm just here to tell you that don't sweat the small stuff like seriously venue venue is super important um your guests are going to care about your venue along with food and drinks and stuff so yeah i said programs yeah people don't really care about those another thing that i've kind of seen that has gone away and that guests don't really care about or feel uncomfortable with is garter removal really happy that's that, that's going away though because i've experienced some awkward ones and i've experienced some awesome ones that have been like so funny but just really happy that's going away because it's so uncomfortable for everyone honestly like come on <laughs> like me and jesse did it at our wedding and i <laughs> i wish we wouldn't have but but Jesse was like funny about it, so it's fine. Really happy that's going away, and you guys really don't care to see that. So, highly recommend not doing a garter removal, and definitely not like putting the garter back on the girl who caught the bouquet because that's even more awkward. No one wants to witness that. <laughs> so yeah, definitely not that. Um, let's uh, move on to speeches. <laughs> oh, speeches. Okay, love a good speech. I love the speeches from the dads, all that stuff. Um, if you're a maid of honor, best man, please keep your speeches short and sweet. Um, nobody cares about your drunken nights in college. Sorry, hate to break it to you. Just nobody cares about that and nobody cares about your inside jokes. Like, just keep it short and sweet and to the point and just how happy you are for the couple and how much they mean to you, blah, 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 you know? so many times like people bring in backstories that nobody knows about so they can't really connect and i get it you want to like talk about your friendship with that person um but maybe like say that to them like outside of the speech you know and <laughs> it was funny because i was just talking to a vendor and it is so true how we do this but we're <laughs> We almost treat this speech as if like that person is dying <laughs> and it's true though like that's what that's just because we're like pouring it all out there you know we're in the fields like I get it I totally get it but <laughs> just keep it short and sweet and to the point because like I said your guests just like don't care about the drunken times you guys had together or ex-girlfriends, ex-boyfriends, heck no. No, 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 that is a major no. Just, if you're a bride watching this, <laughs> remind your best man, or your groom and his best man, and then your maid of honor, to not bring those into <laughs> their speech because, yeah, for all the reasons I just said. So these next couple things, like yes they matter but you don't have to stress about it because your guests are not gonna be criticizing them centerpieces <laughs> um i feel as if a lot of brides stress about centerpieces because they want them to be like extravagant and as beautiful as possible and i totally get that um but your guests don't they're not gonna really pay attention to their centerpieces they're gonna be mingling, they're gonna be talking, they're gonna be up at the table. Most of them, they're not there to criticize your centerpieces or your wedding in general. And if they are, then they shouldn't be there. Yeah, so centerpieces aren't something to really freak out or stress about unless that is something super important to you. Do it. <laughs> you just, again, need some simple flowers. Simple, simple centerpiece is all you need. You don't need to go all out. Okay, and then one more thing i think this is gonna be it hopefully nothing else comes to my mind your guests do not care about what your cake looks like they care probably what it tastes like if you're serving cake but honestly ditch the cake different desserts like cookies cupcakes donuts like those are in right now like those are trendy and honestly no one ever eats cake so why have it have a candy bar have like something cute and easy and something that everyone likes because not everyone likes cake anyway um so that's why your guests don't really care about it and they don't care what it looks like like i said so anywho yeah i guess that would i don't know i feel like i'm forgetting some things but i mean honestly don't stress about little things don't make your wedding you don't need to go all out for your wedding you are marrying the love of your life and that's freaking the only thing that matters it's gonna be so much fun i'm telling you right now something is gonna go wrong on your wedding day it happens and 
everything every time always works out i promise you just have to you just have to not stress i know that is like so hard to comprehend but you just have to you have to just know that everything is going to be okay and you at the end of the day you're going to be married to your best friend and that's freaking awesome um so don't worry about the small things do what you love you don't have to do the traditional things either like i said you don't have to do favors you don't have to do all that if you don't want to if you do if your heart is like wow i really care about favors then do it like i'm not telling you not to do these things i'm just kind of giving you things to not stress about as much because i feel that this is important especially since i am a wedding photographer and i give this advice to like most of my brides i try my best to tell everyone but it's so hard so that's why i wanted to put this out there so if you are my bride you can watch this i love you <laughs> but yeah so i think that's gonna be it i don't know let me know if you guys like these videos i know like i'm trying to do photographer related things but i'm also trying to do stuff for my brides too because i know a lot of you are subscribed and i love that yeah so trying to do the best of both worlds here because i've been a bride myself like i said i'm a wedding photographer i see so many things and i'm just trying to give advice out there to you girls because it's much needed <laughs> Yeah, thank you so much for watching and clicking this video. Subscribe if you haven't yet and give this video a thumbs up. I'd love to see you around, even though I don't see your face. <laughs> you see mine, but whatever. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna peace out now. I will see you guys in the next video.